It's the time of year when fall festivities are in full swing. I traveled to Mother Goose and Beans in Earhart, Minnesota, where they're offering fall fun for the whole family. So it started with a trip I took with my sister and my mom to Wisconsin about this time of the year. Becca Dillon didn't expect to find inspiration for a new business venture when on a girl's trip, but she did. I had so many different kinds of pumpkins that I had never seen before, and it was just inspiring. I thought, we don't have anything like that here. We have the plain pumpkins, the orange, the, the, the jack-o'-lanterns, the, maybe the minis, but there are so many more varieties out there. So that's what inspired the, the whole idea, and I thought, we can bring this, you know, to our county. So in 2014, the Dillons started growing and selling unique pumpkin varieties in their backyard and named their business Mother Goose and Beans. The name comes from me, Mother. Goose and Beans is the nicknames that we used for our twin daughters. So that's why I like the punctuation in it. It's three different people. I actually built a, like a one row of planters so I can drive a tractor. My wife and kids sit on this planter and they drop the seeds in and and go from there. Becca's husband, Pat Dillon, is a farmer and grows corn and soybeans. He has seen a definite correlation between growing pumpkins and more traditional crops. Pumpkins like nutrients like everything else, and if we have a good year on the farm, it, it definitely shows in the pumpkins also. And weed pressure, if you keep them clean, they do a lot better. Besides pumpkins, Mother Goose and Beans has a nine acre corn maze, photo ops, homemade kettle corn, and more. They open up their farmyard to families each fall to come out and enjoy. And they even host field trips and fundraisers, too. Uh, it gets a little hectic at times, but I always say we ought to have to have something to do when other people are sleeping. <laughs> I look around the yard and I see families, be it taking pictures, uh, picking out pumpkins, even the kid that's melting down, whatever it might be, um, people sitting and enjoying the music, um, just conversing with one another, people running into each other. I love watching that this has become a tradition for these people. Thanks for watching Ag Week TV on YouTube. Make sure to like and subscribe. We put out new videos every Saturday.